Hello, my name is Monica Riccelli. I will be covering today WebLogic Server 12 to 1 Continuous Availability. Safe Harbor Statement, the development, release, and timing of any features or functionality described for Oracle products remains the sole discretion of Oracle. WebLogic Server 12CR2 Continuous Availability is the basis of application services that run on the Oracle Cloud platform. Today, I will be covering WebLogic Server Continuous Availability, key features in continuous availability, multi-data center architectures, and the benefits of continuous availability. WebLogic Server Continuous Availability is an integrated solution for multi-data centers. In the past, in WebLogic Server and Coherence, we have offered features that support high availability. But never before have we had an integrated solution end-to-end -to, -end to support multi-data center resilience. With continuous availability, we can provide active-active continuous availability with applications running active-active multi-data center environment. And when one of the sites fails, the other one will take over and applications can continue doing their work. We provide, with continuous availability, reduced application downtime, allowing you to apply patches with zero impact to your applications, or recovery in a very quick fashion, not impacting applications that need to access their services and data. And then what ties it all together is automated data center setup and failover. Reduced application downtime can be achieved with zero downtime patching. Zero downtime patching is the ability for application updates to be done through automated and orchestrated patch rollouts with rollback on error. Oracle Homes, Java Homes, and even your applications can be updated. Coherence 12 to 1 provides recoverable persistent caching. The ability of cache data and metadata to be stored in durable storage. On the failure of one server in the, in the coherence cluster or the entire coherence cluster, the ability to very quickly, in an automated fashion, recover that cache data with zero impact to applications. In multi-tenant environments, we provide multi-tenant live partition migration. It's the ability to migrate running partitions and resources without impacting applications from one cluster to another. Continuous availability also offers the ability to replicate state. Cross-domain transaction recovery allows for the recovery of transaction in active-active configurations, where one domain fails on site one or the entire site fails, the servers running on a WebLogic server domain on site 2 can recover transactions for the failed site. Coherence Multi-Data Center Federated Caching distributes coherence updates with conflict resolution across different geographical areas. It can be active-active, where replication happens constantly and applications have local access to their data, to their cache data. Active-passive, where the passive site becomes backup for the active site. And then hub-spoke, where the hub can replicate its cache data to different geographical areas. Continuous availability also has operational support for site failover. Oracle Traffic Director, a very fast, scalable, and reliable load balancer. Oracle Traffic Director is, is aware of server availability. If servers are added to the cluster, it immediately will route traffic to those new servers. Oracle Traffic Director itself can be highly available in an active-active or active-passive mode. And then finally, what brings it all together, Oracle SiteGuard, which provides end-to-end -end disaster recovery automation. You can predefine your site components, any scripts that you want run during failover or switchback, 
and the order that you want these components to be started. This reduces human error because there is no manual intervention. Continuous availability provides support and benefits to our customers in different kinds of topologies to meet their application needs, whether that be active-passive, active-active, or active-active stretch cluster. To recap, the benefits of continuous availability, it's an integrated solution end-to-end, active-active availability of sites, fast failover and switchover, reducing human error and risk, increases overall application availability, data integrity, recovery of work, and local access of real-time data. Now, I will give a demo of SiteGuard. I first will log on into Enterprise Manager, go into my systems, and there I have Site A and Site B. Site A is the primary with a green arrow, and Site B has a red arrow, is the standby. I will start a switchover process. I go to SiteGuard, Operations, and I'm going to do a switch over from Site A to Site B. Execute operations, advance operations, and I enable the run pre-checks. So now I start the switch over process. You can see here how in sequence it runs the pre-checks. It mounts the file system in the primary machine and switches it over and then mounts it on the standby machine. It switches over the databases. It starts the standby site and then it runs the post scripts. Now, after successful switchover, you see site roles are now reversed. Site A is standby with a red arrow, and Site B has a green arrow, is a primary site. Please join the WebLogic server community on Twitter, Facebook, LinkedIn, YouTube, and our Oracle WebLogic server blog. Thank you very much.